Hi everyone, Sailor Moon here, and Sailor Mars here. Is my hair a mess? I don't know. Anyway, and today we're going to talk about some Santa Claus, two Santa Claus skits, or segments, that happened on Monday Night Raw. Now the first one was actually a WWE made commercial for WWEshop.com as Mick Foley as Santa Claus. And he shows all the accessories or all the merchandise that one could buy. Now, for example, there's so much stuff that he can't talk about at all. Well, first he shows off a replica of a Slammy and says that this is what the W Superstars er, win at the Slammy Awards every year. He then tells one of his elves to give it to so-and-so. Then... The WWE World Heavyweight Championship replica. He makes some joke and says that we're going to give this to Lema, we're going to give to Al at Lema, Ohio. Basically, making a reference to Al Snow, of course. Then, he also brings up the Macho Man documentary, Macho Man Madness. It was called Macho Madness. And one of the L's says, ask me if I'm a Randy Savage fan. You a Randy Savage fan? He goes, oh yeah. Then after that, he talks about the Primo code that you put in to get a discount on the on the price of either the shipping and handling part of the merchandise. And then at the end, the female elf goes, that's a bomb line to Santa said so. And he goes, nope, that's Stone Cold Boston's gimmick. We don't want to infringe upon it. The next Santa Claus skit, can I do it now, Sailor Moon? Okay, all right, okay. The next Santa Claus skit was a part of Monday Night Raw. This time Hulk Hogan goes to Santa Claus. But he calls himself Ho Ho Hogan. But you could call him either Hulk Claus or Santa Hogan if you wanted. He got about three different aliases. So he comes out of Monday Night Raw. Tells every wish everybody a Merry Christmas, a Happy Hanukkah, and a Happy Kwanzaa, and a Happy Solstice. Winter Solstice. He then goes to tell everybody he's booked the following matches. Roman Reigns against Big Show. Dean Ambrose against Bray Wyatt in the Miracle and 34th Street match. John Cena comes out and says that, yeah, he lost to Seth Rollins last week. And that, unlike most superstars that would complain and make excuses about the loss, he says he's not. He says he wants... Santa Ho, he wants Santa Hogan, or Hulk Claus, or Ho Hogan, to, uh, grant him his return match. Seth Rollins then comes out, says that it's a joke that Hulk Hogan and Santa Claus is overseeing Monday Night Raw. It says he tells Ho Ho Hogan, or Hulk Claus, or, you know, Santa Hogan to get John Cena to give the authority their booking power once again. John Cena says that the authority will not be coming back anytime soon. Santa Hogan or, you know, Hulk Claus or Ho-Ho Hogan then books John Cena against Seth Rollins. After that, there's a post down between Hulk Hogan and Santa Claus and John Cena. That was the only, the only part of the show that you saw Hulk Hogan as Santa Claus, or as Ho Ho Hogan, or as Hulk Claus, or Santa Hogan, you can call them multiple different aliases or combinations. But those are the two Santa Claus segments or skits, and they happen on Monday Night Raw. There might be one on Main Event, but I don't think there will be. And as far as TNA is concerned, they're just recapping everything that happened over the year. So I don't think that TNA is going to be doing any kind of Christmas themed impact wrestling. And if they are, it's just going to basically be them recapping every Santa Claus segment they had on impact wrestling going back to the first one. So that's about it. I'm Sailor Moon, Sailor Mars. We'll see you tomorrow.